having seen Lorient overhaul them on Saturday as they kicked their heels in the Normandy fog, Caen had added motivation to triumph to move back ahead of Le Merleau and return the Breton club to 20th place. So the sight of Metz arriving at the Stade d'Ornano would have brightened spirits for the Pinchberger's side, having lost four of their last five on the road. Patience from the powers that be have allowed Patrice Garan to try and remedy a campaign that's provided just four wins in 16 matches. This time last year, the Normans were riding high on the podium and they produced a performance that was of that quality. Jan Caramo with an opener goal. The teenager scoring eight consecutive matches. A terrific header from a superb Vincent Bassa assist. And the Ivorian was involved again, this time being the provider for the post coming to Thomas Dillion's rescue. Rodi Rodon unlucky there. Mess were unable to stop the production line of headed opportunities. Rodolan again unable to add to his tally of three for the season. Well, Mess fortunate that they trailed by only one at the break. Caen aiming to snap a four-match winless streak and secure only a second victory in their past 11 league matches. Past meetings, though, suggested Mess could get something. They were unbeaten in four against Caen before this. Although visibility was dwindling, it didn't stop referee Francois Letessier spotting something off the ball. A moment of madness as the red mist descended on Milan Bisevac, punching Ivan Santini and receiving, rightly, second red card. Santini got the perfect revenge four minutes later. A stunning effort just past the hour mark. An eighth of the season. But he certainly likes the Donano because it's his seventh at home. Stunning curling effort for three goals in two matches after a brace against Dijon. Metz did have opportunities, but of the four shots on target, Mathieu Trea kept them out. The keeper with his first appearance after Paul René had conceded seven in two matches since number one Remy Vercutre was injured against Gangon. Can press for more as they went in search of their biggest league win since beating Bordeaux 4 1 two years ago. Canoma denied there, though. Even when Metz managed to beat Trea, they couldn't beat the post. And a first clean sheet since beating Nice 1 0 in week 12 was suddenly on the cards. The Normans did manage to seal their most impressive win of the season. Pap Sane with his first league on goal to make it three. 12 goals for Bergeron Press in League 2 last season. It may have not been the most cultured of finishes, but they all count. A huge win for Garan and Caen as they climb off the foot of the table. And one place above Metz to sit 16th, just a goal difference.